this time. Hi, my name is Anjali Bodanti. I'm in first grade. Today, my science project is about static electricity. My questions are, why does my hair stand up and attract towards the balloon that is started by rubbing it on my head? Two, why does the empty soda can roll towards the balloon that was charged by rubbing it on the sweater? My, my hypothesis is, I think that the... I think that the empty soda can and my hair and the and the hair will move towards the balloon that was tried by rubbing it on my hair or sweater. So these are the materials that I'm gonna have for these for this project. A balloon, an empty an empty soda can, my hair, and the sweater I'm wearing. Procedure number one. Blow up the balloon and tie. I did that already. Now I'm gonna put it on my head and in the air. You see, nothing's happening. Just like in the photo. See? Back up. Now I'm gonna put it on my head and rub it and lift it up. You see, it is attracting towards the blue. Because of static electricity. Oh, and I forgot to show you two more photos for this procedure. So this is what I'm rubbing, and this is when it's attracting towards the balloon. Now, that was, pr that was what my first procedure. Now, my procedure number two is, I'm going to put this on the ground, I mean, on the side, on the table. Now I'm going to put it one inch away from the balloon. You see, nothing's happening. Now I'm going to rub this balloon on a sweater. Now I'm going to put it close to this balloon. You see, it's rolling. Yes. I'm a, and, and this is something else you can do. You can stand it up. Oh, and now I'm going to, and you can see it's rolling because of static electricity. These are the pictures. So in this picture, nothing's happening. In this picture, the can is rolling towards the balloon. My results are when you rub a balloon on your hair or sweater, ends up loaded with electrons which are also called as negatives. Those electrons can attract to, pos to protons which are also called positives in a soda can or in my hair. So positively charged hair and a negatively charged balloon will, uh, will attract will, will, and, will, and, starts, and my hair will start to rise up to meet it. Two things with different charges, a positive and a negative will we'll stick together, which also means attract. Thing with the same charge, two positives or two negatives, will repel, which also means push away from each other. My conclusion is, you can create static electricity by rubbing one object on an, against another object. This is because the rubbing releases the negative charge called electrons. The electrons can build up to produce a static charge. The thing with the opposite charges will attract, and the thing with the same charges repel. This is what all, my whole science project is about. Thank you, and have a nice day.